next video lecture i'm going to discuss about how to install python in microsoft sql server then run python script inside the microsoft sql server so first here i'm going to do the installation of sql server 2019 is the current version so let's click on the setup there after here you can see installation wizard so click on install new sql server I'll stand alone there after here click on next so here this is doing the checking of updates so net must be connected okay so first you need to download the Microsoft SQL server then you can do the installation there no updates click next then after this is doing install setup files so there is no any problem next so this you can select to evaluation express developer click next then after here you need to accept next then after here you can get the important things so first you need to select database engine then after select here python so this lecture is about to install python in sql server so select the python after doing this one click on this next so this is the uh, detail you can see there after default no need to change click next then after please wait so this is the here server configuration no need to change anything next then database so here let's use mixed mode so this is now system administrator sa give the password then after add current user then you can get here Thereafter here you can see this is Anaconda is Python distributed this all those things Anaconda that's for click on accept then next button that will enable okay so thereafter you can get here features so click on next then after this is the important steps so here you can see install path so setup was unable to contact the download server so you need to download this too so here copy this one and uh, open any of your favorite browser there you need to paste so automatically the download will start so here this is now 625 MB and thereafter you need to download the next uh, here second one so copy that one thereafter paste there press enter the second download file that will automatically appear there so here you can see this is the 207 MB so this two that I already downloaded so I'm going to pause that so this two that I already downloaded after that here you can see this I downloaded here is python file so these two files okay so for this location you need to copy or paste there so if you paste it will not take so click on this browse there after desktop then you can search here python file okay so you can see next button that is disable click on ok then this will start reading the files so when that file that read then automatically next button that enable click on next after that so this is the summary you can get here ok this is the summary so after that you need to click on this install button then now you will install successfully python in microsoft sql server here so it will take some time so i'm going to pause the video see installing spo.cap 8 mb so 99 percent that installation part that has been done only few are left so it will only take some times to complete this process the information about the set of operation possible next step so python machine learning service and language extension and database 
Enjoy service 3 that successfully install. So install successful. This is the details. So after that, uh, here you can see the summary log files, the following location. This is the summary. If you want, then you can check. This is the text file is there. So it's a uh, successful. After that, you need to click on this close. Installation. Let's uh, search here SSMS. Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio 18. So it's opening now. 2020 Microsoft. After that, give the user and the password. Click on this connect. Thereafter, here you can select any database. Click on this new query. So new query here. You need to write this. So this that I already written to save some times. Copy. You should try directly. Okay. So first here connect the instance where machine service are installed. So select this one, execute. So here you can get allow polybase, this all those things, default language. Okay, max text and thereafter here to enable the external scripting features that support the python you need to execute this query so here configure option ex external script enable change from 1 to 1 if that 0 then that change to 1 ok after that we need to print to we need to check the and here uh, we need to print hello world with this query ok so if you execute here you can see the hello world that is the uh, uh, printing with the help of uh, this python inside microsoft sql server ok so execute as store procedure a store procedure execute external script language that is python and a script print hello world that using here so this is the way we can install python and run the script run the python scripts inside the microsoft sql server so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you